Hi, uh, this is Panindra here. Let us discuss Tableau tip number one. Today I am going to show you how to perform the weighted averages using Tableau. And uh, I have already imported the, uh, loaded the tables from the database and this is how it looks. I have created a new uh, worksheet here and have named it as weighted averages. Now let us drop the uh, facts into the rows and columns. First, let us drag the subcategory into the rows. Product subcategory. You can see all these listed over here. And in the columns, let us take the sales amount and sales quantity. We will make the sales amount, the measure will be average, you can see the average sales amount and this is the sales quantity. Now to perform the weighted averages we have to create uh, two new calculated fields. The calculated fields will be created uh, in the following manner, we will go to analysis this option here create calculated field the first one will we we'll name it as uh, weight and this is how the formula sum you can see uh, all those things will be auto populated we'll take sales quantity we will divide it by this window sum sum of sales quantity comma first comma last this first and last is in such a way that the first will return the number of rows from the current row to the first row in the partition table Similarly, the uh, last will return the number of rows from the current row to the last row in the partition table. Okay, and as and when you create, you can see a new fact uh, entity will get created under the measures. Similarly, we have to create one more calculated field. Uh, let us uh, name it as weighted average sales amount so we will average of sales amount multiplied by weight Can you see these two weighted, uh, uh, sorry, new calculated field added over under measures table? Let us drag these two things over here. So now this is our weighted average ratio with respect to all our subcategories and this would be the weight. This is how we will calculate the weighted average ratio. Thank you.